So I'm Francois K and we are here at the Dillon Hotel as part of the Amsterdam Dance Music Event also known as ADE 2009. I have a record label, a production company, a publishing company, had a recording studio, professional activity. I'm a DJ and producer. I'm sure that I'm somewhat qualified somewhere in there to have an opinion on a lot of topics. So yeah, I mean, you know, obviously I've been doing this for a great deal of time and I think what people are looking for is, uh, for me, sometimes a bit more of a perspective on you know what it really means or how what kind of change certain things represent or that kind of stuff I have different setups but I guess as far as uh, traveling I'm just carrying uh, you know a 15 inch MacBook Pro with lots and lots of stuff loads of plugins Pro Tools, Logic and Ableton Live uh, UAD plugins as an external and lots of other software depending on what I need to do really uh, so that's for the traveling part with like those little Korg microcontrollers and then uh, in the studio that's not a setup it's more like a, a disaster area of consoles and synthesizers and whatever you want that I guess is the result of having accumulated gear for over 30 years so there's everything you want and it's all hodgepodge and there's no order whatsoever in what it does or how it does it. Digital audio files as they were first created we need, meaning CD quality, red book audio has really not evolved for almost 30 years since it was created and I just uh, find it difficult that, uh, to admit that uh, people are satisfied with the same standard that was developed with the technical limitations of the time 30 years ago when everything else around us has so much evolved like digital cameras, storage devices, computers and all that so I'm struggling to understand why instead of going in the better we've gone the other direction and there's a lot of people calling themselves DJs who just feel that playing you know reduced fidelity you know compressed audio is a solution when in fact it does a great disservice to the music by almost like emasculating it of all its live qualities and making it really an approximation of music rather than what it's supposed to be so Sometimes I think to myself, why is it that no one has seemed to care? But why is it that video cameras, digital cameras for still pictures and all other forms of media are still evolving and getting so much better, except audio is not, it's going worse. I, I don't have the answer to the question, but I think for every DJ that's thinking that it's good enough to play MP3 because they sounded good enough at home, I'd like to remind them that when I go in a big club, it doesn't sound good enough. It sounds ho or horrible or awful or pathetic, depending on which ones.